You're giving in an empty test. Jules. Or be a pole, fill it for me. You're asking me to complete your test for you? Really? What is it difficult? <laughs> wow. I give you an F. <laughs> wait, wait, there is no need for a conflict. We can do it in a business-like, peaceful way. No, I have a really, really long tongue. And I can accidentally tell everyone about you and the principal and what you're doing in his room, in his office. Oh, you're a scandalous teacher. Wait, what are you talking about? Oh, don't pretend to be an angel. Just think, a teacher and a married principal. Who wouldn't thought? Okay, how do you know? Oh, it doesn't matter. What matters now is that what will happen to your reputation? Oh, what will happen to the principal's reputation? Fill in the test. I don't think you want that to your lover, do you? No, I don't. Oh, great. Then I'm looking forward to you for the next class. When you announce that I got the high grade. Thank you. <laughs> Carl? Who do we have here? Amanda. Did the sound just rise right in my office? Oh, Carl, please, not now. We need to talk. Later. No. Now. What? One of my students is blackmailing me. What do you mean? She asked me to complete her test or otherwise she will tell everyone about us. <gasps> Carl, I think that we hid it for too long. I think it's time for us to officially become a couple. You know, you divorced your wife, so what's stopping us? Well, um... Wait. You divorced your wife, right? It's not that simple, Amanda. I'm in the process. What do you mean, in the process? You said that it's done. I say everything is not that simple. But believe me, I'm doing everything possible to speed up this process. Amanda, sunshine, don't worry. We'll be able to come out soon. We just have to wait a little longer. But if someone finds out about our relationships, it's gonna be catastrophic for your divorce. Therefore, I'm very, very much asking you to accept the conditions of this student. Only once. It pains me to ask for you. But do you promise to divorce soon? I promise. Okay, I'll do it for you. Good girl. You again, Jules. You don't need to be so mean. I just wanted to say thank you for the help with the exam. I don't know what would I do without you. You're welcome. Anything else? No. Although, yes. I was thinking about it and I want to go to Westbrook University. Will you help? And what do I have to do with that? Oh, you're always willing to help the students. Also, I had to write a cover letter, and I think you know exactly how to write it to get me there. Get out of here, Jules. Oh, remind me, why did you agree to give me 100 points? Yeah, that was just a test. And now the future of other students is at stake? Students who don't just wait around for something to fall from the sky. For some of them, this is their only chance. Oh, this is my only chance to... This is my only chance to get a new car. <laughs> my dad promised me to get a new car for me if I got to the university. You don't know how hard it is to live without my own car. You are crazy, Jules. And I'm not going to help you. Are you sure? Absolutely. And what would our principal say about this? This is no longer your problem, Jules. Well, 
I think I'll give you some time, Mrs. Clayton. You can discuss it with your lover boy and make a good decision. I'm waiting for the good news. That's it, Carol. We can't do this anymore. Jules went way too far with her blackmail now. We have to put her in her place. Why are you yelling? Calm down. How do you want me to be calm when this little brat keeps blackmailing me? Do you know what she wants now? Westberg University. Well, is that a problem? What? Are you being serious right now? Absolutely. She can go wherever she wants. Excuse me? You said yourself that she would tell everyone about our relationship. I can't allow that. I don't understand why you're being so worried about everyone finding out about us. You will get divorced anyway. There will be no divorce, Amanda. And there never was, okay? What? But... You said that... <laughs> yes, I lied to you. And you naively believed it. And now, my dear, you will now go and do whatever this little fool wants. Otherwise, you'll be fired. Moreover, I will make sure that you will never teach again. Did you understand me? I did not expect that. What a pity. But I don't care. I ask again, do you understand me? Yes. Well done. We have great news today. We sent our students' applications to the University of Westbrook. The committee liked one of the cover letters so much that they came here to meet the author in person. Good afternoon, students. I'm Phil Mayfield, the head of Westbrook University Admissions. It's great to meet you. One of the students was admitted to the ranks of perhaps the most prestigious university in the world. Please give it up for Jules Fox. Nice to meet you, Jules. We would like to ask you a few questions about your letter. Jules, don't be ashamed. You have a very interesting essay. I like the part about blackmailing the teacher the most. What inspired you to write this? Well, well, I'm talking about how you made Miss Clayton take the test for you, threatening to reveal her relationship with the principal. You're mistaken, sir. She couldn't write such nonsense, We are right? talking to Jules now. So. It was a really incredible letter, Jules. It's a pity you didn't write it, so we can't accept you to Westberg. Our doors will never open for dishonest people. But we would love to invite a few other students for an interview. What about you, Mr. Delaney? I doubt you will be able to stay on as principal if you allow blackmail in your school. Well. The board has already been informed about this matter. For our part, we are recommending a new candidate for your replacement. Ms. Clayton. of her reputation and work continues to stand up for justice. Listen, it's all just a fake. You can't just rely on words.
Hi, it's me, Gary, the showrunner of Dramatizing. Nice to see you guys again. We are about to hit 2 million subscribers and now we really need your help. Like, share this video and of course don't forget to subscribe to our channel. Take care and see ya!